I'm straight. This is Tatum Bethune. So Tatum, just kind of talk about the win tonight. The defense had to step up. Offense was a little bit slow to get going. Just you know, how excited were you guys to you know kind of help the team to help deliver the team a victory? Uh, you know, it's always exciting playing at home. You know, just playing football in general, but it's just different when we're home. It's it was good having a feeling of the offense just coming back and doing what they got to do regardless of what happens with, with the other drive and the defense. We just kept the mindset of, like just keep going no matter what happens. Just play the next play. I don't know how many. Oh, sorry. I don't yeah. know how many uh, batted balls you had tonight, but I remember at least one or two of them. What is it about the ability to jump and get the pass and bat it down? Uh, you know, I just try to time it up, and my, my hands are big. I wear three X and gloves, so I know I gotta use them somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> so, say um, uh, in the game, uh, you yourself uh, definitely shot some gaps, had to get to the backfield. The whole defensive line yeah. was challenging up front. Starting the year, you guys weren't exactly the same force attacking the backfield. Kind yeah. of take us through what's different between then and now. Uh, you know, just practice and then watch a film. You know, Talking with T. Willie, talking to me, Bryce, and Jeremiah, and the rest of the linebackers a lot about running our feet and don't stop when we get in the hole and just shoot the gap and be confident in what we're doing. So as this changed, we worked on it in practice. It just changed a lot, as you can see on the field. Coach Malzahn says that the defense is taking on the identity of T. Will. What does that mean? Uh, you know, like we said before the season started, a lot of people didn't know how Coach T. Will was. We said he was a high energy guy. I know you see on third downs like how we get off the field, we're dancing, and just we're just happy to be here, happy to make plays, and T. Will is just right with us, so it's just like we reflect off him. Whatever you do, we do. Tim, what's kind of like? What's it like playing for the defense right now? You guys, you're coming off a string of really successful games, you know, limiting the other teams in points, playing well, much better than the beginning of the season. What's it like? Are you guys starting to kind of hit your groove? Yeah, you know, uh, our main focus was really to have fun. We talked about that. I know Big Cat mentioned it before. And that's, that's just what we do to have fun. And what we keep saying in meeting rooms before the game and during the week, we just got to keep that edge going, regardless of how good we're doing. That's in the past. We got to play the next game. So the defense double digit tackles for loss. How does that improve the energy that has kept that momentum going throughout the rest of the game? Um, you know, in our D line, I feel like we have one of these, the best D line groups in the country. And I tell them all the time, like, this defense revolves around them. And whatever they do, that's how far the defense is going to go. So I feel like the most of their top losses was from them. So yeah, I could ask them to let them. You guys are bowl eligible now. What does that mean to you? Uh, you know, in bowl, there's a few games after we got to worry about next week now. So it's a good feeling. It's a great feeling. But we worry about next week. That's what we do. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot, Thanks, Taylor. Thanks, Taylor. Thanks.